It's almost Christmas time now. You know what that means. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a Christmas wish list gift ideas video. A lot of these are things that I would ask for or I would think that people my age would ask for that I think you might be interested in. I feel like I know you guys pretty well. So I thought I would compile a bunch of stuff so that's easier for you to make a wish list for Christmas. If you're using this as a video to get someone something that can be helpful. Really quickly before we get into it, I do want to thank Enroot Jewelry. I have worked with them before as you guys have probably seen. I'm obsessed with their jewelry. I wanted to put them on this list of things to put on your wish list because genuinely their jewelry is so good for a much lower price than a lot of other places and they're having a 35% discount site-wide for Black Friday. Make sure to head over to their site. I wanted to show you my jewelry really quick that they sent over to me. These earrings that I'm wearing that I'm literally obsessed with. I have the matching necklace. I also got the matching ring. It's just like this really pretty like black heart with a bunch of detail and then I got this simple little chain that I'm wearing. These cute little clothes earrings and these little cute puffs which I think are adorable so make sure to go check them out they have such good basic jewelry but then also some really unique pieces so if you want some cute jewelry for Christmas put that on your wish list because it's great their links will be in the description box so let's just get into it and get on with the rest of the list I will put each category on a timestamp right here so you can skip if you want a certain thing and of course I will have everything that I show linked down below okay so for the first category I am doing clothes slash shoes and accessories Number one, some Converse. I actually already asked for Converse for Christmas. My stepmom was asking me if I wanted anything in particular, and I really want forest green Converse. They think they're adorable. I see fun colored Converse all over Pinterest. I have red ones that I love. They're great. They're so fun for styling and super cute. Number two, cowboy boots. They're super, super trendy, so cute. I really like how they look with dresses, and they're just super cute. Some Doc Martens, those are great. I have like the simple black chunky ones. Some cute, fun heels. Heels. I have been really into heels even though I never wear them. I think they're so cute. Princess Polly has some really cute ones. ASOS has some really cute ones. Hair clips. I have a few of these and I use them all the time. Princess Polly has ones made well. Honestly, you can get them anywhere. Amazon, Target. But I really like the claw clips. Those are great. Simple little stocking stuff or something. Blue light glasses. They're great if you spend a lot of your time on your computer, doing homework, doing work, whatever you're doing, or on your phone. Okay, puffer jackets. North Face if you want a really like, good quality one, but it is a bit of pricier if you want a a cheaper one. Princess Polly has really good ones. ASOS, H&M. Um, I will link my favorites. Baseball caps. I'm obsessed with baseball caps right now. Depop has super cute ones. Brandy has a really cute one. Urban Outfitters. Amazon has some really cute ones as well. Flannels, especially for the fall and the winter. Princess Polly has cute ones. Urban, PacSun. A faux leather jacket. It is a must for your closet. I have one from Princess Polly that I really like, but they also have a bunch on Depop. And I'll link some of my other favorites down below. Tights or knee-high socks. These are great for styling. Yeah. I think they're super cute. Skirts, plaid ones, pleated ones, cargo pants. I love cargo pants. Sunglasses. My favorite ones right now are from Target actually and then I also have a pair from Urban Outfitters that I really like. Button up shirt. Like this style is so cute. Getting Boutique has some, Target, a bunch of different places. Crewnecks and hoodies. Brandy is my absolute favorite for those type of things. A small purse is super cute if you don't need to carry a lot around and it's just like more of like an outfit accessory. Phone cases. Roughly socks are great for like stocking stuffer or headbands. They're super cute as well. Duffel bags. I have one from Brandy that I really like but Paxson also also has some Los Angeles apparel, has some really good basic ones. Sweatpants, if you don't have enough or you want a particular pair. Cotton On has some great ones, Brandy, packs and Urban Outfitters. Fitted tanks, kind of like the one I'm wearing now. These are great basics for styling. Sweater vests, Air Force Ones, well, I slide those on like literally almost every day. A cardigan, oversized graphic tees, Brandy Urban Outfitters, they have really good ones. Beanies for styling in the winter, slides like Nike or Adidas. Okay, moving on to the next section, which is like home bath and room decor type stuff. A new comforter, cover, some new sheets. I, I love that stuff. I feel like that's a great thing to ask for if you haven't gotten new ones in a while. Urban Outfitters has really cute bedding. So does Anthropology, but it's a little bit pricier and also Target has really good stuff too. Silk pillowcases. I have these ones from Kitsch. I think it's that's how you say it. And they're super cute, really comfortable. They're supposedly better for your hair and your skin. A makeup mirror. I feel like that's something everyone needs. I kind of use a really small mirror, so I feel like that would be a nice gift. Like a bigger makeup mirror that you can put on 
their desk. Cozy slippers. Madewell, ASOS, and Anthropology have literally such cute ones. A robe, like a nice fuzzy cozy one. I saw some cute ones on Pottery Barn and Victoria's Secret always has really good ones. A microfiber hair towel. I saw some good ones on Kitsch and this Volo one looks really nice. A record player or a speaker. A record player if you're into records or a speaker if you don't have one for your room, for working out, whatever. Candles. I included an article in the description of supposedly the best smelling candles. A perfume tester set as if you don't have a particular perfume that you love that would let you smell a bunch and then choose which one you really like and then you can buy it. A diffuser. These are very like calming. You put some oils in there like scented lavender, mint, whatever. A collage kit or like wall art. A reusable water bottle. Hydro flask. They also have great ones at Target. Mine's from Target and I use it all the time. Throw blankets are always great. I can't get enough of them. I love the ones from Target but literally any home stores, home goods, anything like that. Pajama sets. I saw some cute ones on Nap Loungewear and Cozy Earth. Those look adorable and they look super comfortable. These terrarium candles, like little cactuses and flowers and stuff, are so cute. A makeup bag or makeup organizer. A Keurig coffee maker or any type of coffee maker that you may want if you like coffee. I am not really a coffee person but <laughs> I know that a lot of people are so that would be a great one. A jewelry holder slash case. I feel like this is such a good gift especially if you're into jewelry and if you get some en route jewelry like I have. A jewelry organizer or case literally helps so much. Plants. If you're a plant person, some really cute aesthetic plants like jars or planters for them. Silk robes instead of fluffy ones if that's your vibe. Silk scrunchies. So it's really good for your hair. That's a nice little stocking stuffer. A sunset lamp. I see these on TikTok sometimes. They're really pretty especially if you take like pictures in your room. Just adds like a really nice warm light. A sketchbook or like art supplies if you draw or paint. A projector. These are great if you don't have a TV in your room but you want to watch like movies on your wall like in your room and stuff. Fun shaped vases. I think these are so cute and if you like to have flowers in your room or you have like the little fake flowers they have a bunch on Etsy. Sleep aid device. So this is basically like helps train your brain how to have a good sleeping schedule if you don't sleep very well and you have problems with that. It has like a, like a timed light type of thing. A temperature control mug to keep your coffee warm at your desk at school whatever. A wooden bathtub tray. This one's kind of random but I thought if you had a, like a nice warm bubble bath and you want to like read a book do some work have a little little tray i don't know okay moving on to the next section like just a general lifestyle section of gifts okay workout set i'm pushing myself to work out a lot more i've actually been doing really good i love workout sets matching top and leggings matching top and shorts aloe is so cute but it's so expensive but um i have one from gymshark lululemon's a little pricey but their quality is really good i'll also link some more affordable ones a yoga mat is great if you work out dumbbells resistant bands anything like that if you do have a workout routine or you want to start working out airpods and headphones tennis shoes, a laptop case. I literally just got a laptop case like a week ago because I was just carrying my laptop in my bag and I was like, you know what, this is gonna break eventually. I need to get a laptop case. A wallet, a subscription box, FabFitFun, anything like that, or like a skincare subscription box. Polaroid camera, if you don't have one, they're super fun. I have one, I love it. An appointment at a spa for like a facial or an appointment for a massage. I would absolutely love that. A notebook or a planner. If they are obsessed with their dogs, get their dogs little sweaters, toys because you know if you love your dog a gift for them is like a gift for you that sounded so cheesy okay moving on to the skincare and beauty section up first the laneige lip mask this is a favorite of many people i have tried it and it does feel really nice it is a bit expensive for a lip mask but if you want to splurge a little bit for something a little bit bougie for your lip the ordinary hyaluronic acid drops supposed to be really good a beauty mini fridge to put all your beauty products in to keep them cold olaplex hair products are supposed to be to die for i've used one the conditioner i did like it i didn't see anything crazy happen with my hair but up Apparently, if you use like all their products, it's supposed to be really good if you've been wanting to try them. Washable makeup remover pads or cloths. I have the cloths and I love them. I use them over and over again. Throw them in the wash and they come out clean. You don't have to waste a ton of makeup remover wipes and stuff. Body butter. The Truly Beauty one is supposed to be really good. And the Sol de Janeiro is supposed to be really nice as well. Pimple patches. That's just a good little stocking stuffer. Hair masks. I love hair masks. The one from Coco and Eve is supposed to be really good. A facial steamer. It helps open your pores if you want to put a mask on. If you want to do like extractions on your face 
face a facial cleansing device i have one but it's like a cheaper version because i'm not about to spend 120 on a little device but they have cheap ones and they have expensive ones if you've been wanting one press on nails i'm a big press on nails gal i do them at home i love them these are from static nails and they also have some cute ones on urban and a bunch of different ones i'll have them linked below heatless curling set from kitsch super cute i've been wanting to try heatless curls and they're supposed to work really well so that's a great one makeup brushes a scalp massager for when you're in the shower and you're washing your hair a new hairbrush teeth whitening kit a henna freckle hen or kit these were super popular for a while but i know a lot of people like to draw on freckles body scrubs lush has great ones bath bombs are a must again lush is perfect for that gua sha i use a gua sha on my face and i love it my camera died as per usual but i was just on the last item a hair dryer volumizer people love the one from revlon so that's a great one okay guys so i hope this is helpful for you to come up with ideas that you want to put on your wish list or that you want to get for someone again thank you to enver jewelry for sending me over some pieces and i will have their stuff linked at the top of the description box and then everything else i talked about in this video underneath that i hope you guys like this video if you did make sure to give it a like i will be doing a wish list ideas from just brandy mobile because a couple of you guys have asked me for that one and you guys seem to like the one last year if you are new here and you haven't subscribed to me and you want to see more from me make sure to hit subscribe it would mean the world to me i love you guys and i'll see you next time